against you guys? Well, they covered the perimeter really well today. Um, they limited our options a lot. They played really, really hard, and they played really fast. Uh, you got to give a lot of credit to those guys and their game plan and, and, and the way that they played and the way that they fought. Uh, you know, they're, they're a great group, and, and they've proven that tonight, and, and uh, they played better than we did. Safe to say nobody saw this kind of thing coming? I mean, yeah, I guess it was a little unexpected um, given the season that we've had so far, and um, I think that makes it hurt just 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 a little bit more. Um, but you know, it's uh, it is what it is. The game happened the way it happened, and um, you just got to go back to work and, and make sure we, that we beat Navy next week. Mike, how, how do you think that the team is going to bounce back? I think the team will be fine. I think there's <coughs> um, a high character in our locker room and, and the players that we have, and I think there's. Um, tremendous coaches in place that nothing's going to falter from this. How did the crowd noise affect you guys, if at all? Um, it just affected the, the snap count. Um, it didn't really bother us too much. I mean, obviously, it gave a little bit of life into the stadium, but, um, you know, other than using a silent count, the, the crowd noise really wasn't wasn't too bad for us. Mike, how much does it change the offense when you guys aren't able to establish a run right away in the game? You know, I, I don't think it really changes much at all. You, you, you got to stick to it, and um, things weren't things were there that we didn't capitalize on um, a lot today. Um, you know, we're, 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 we are who we are, and we're going to stick to what we do, no matter what the circumstance is. And um, I'm proud of our guys for fighting and, and, and staying true to what we are. But you know, we got to execute a lot better throughout the game. We didn't we didn't put together 60 minutes of football. We we uh, we didn't we didn't do enough well today at all. Does it feel like you guys are losing control when you're watching interceptions? Obviously, the offensive line likes to kind of dictate the, the way the offense is going, but when there's interceptions being thrown, how much can you be responsible for that? How can you kind of impact and, and change the way that the things are going? Well, it's a full team responsibility. Um, interceptions and turnovers are a part of the game. Um, there's no one man. To, I mean, it, it, it's a team effort. It doesn't matter who's turning the ball over. Or I can probably protect better on those interceptions. I know the, the rest of the four guys across from me will say the same. Um, obviously, things didn't go their way, and, 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 and that's, part of the, that's part of the game of football. Um, turnovers happen, defense makes plays, and they, they made a lot more plays than we did tonight. What do you need to see from Brandon come out of tonight in terms of just where he's at mentally and what he can do for you guys moving forward? I don't think anybody's worried about Brandon. I think um, he's going to be fine. Obviously, everybody had a rough night tonight, and. Um, it's just growing pains, and you know, you know, it's uh, it's part of the game of football. We've had a great season thus far, and, and we're not going to let one game slip from from what we're trying to accomplish. And um, next thing on our on our agenda is to beat Navy, and, and that's all that we're focused on. And Brandon will be just as focused as the rest of the team.